Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to be doing a mini video for beginners or people that are not used to dealing with these old uh, old dial indicators kind of stuff that you have, for example, on your old voltmeters. Um, what I'm going to be talking about is called parallax error. This is one of the first things you learned or you used to learn when you went to um, electronics school. I don't know if this is a probably not nowadays. Um, what this basically is, is the differences in readings that's basically caused by your position. You can say it's your viewing, it's the error of your viewing angle. And basically if you look at the pointer and the scale from an angle, instead of looking at it straight on, your reading is not going to be correct, right? So here you can see I'm not straight on and it looks like it's actually off but if I would be put my head right in front of the uh, right in front of the dial pointer here and the scale it basically it would basically it's it's I'm pretty well on there uh, also I have to point out of course like when you're using a multimeter if it's off unless you're making really accurate you have to make really accurate measurements this is not really that important right Again, also, the, the greater the distance here between the pointer and the scale, the more it's going to look like you're having an error. So let me go ahead and try to get in a position where I'm straight in front of this thing, and you can see what I'm talking about. I have to go down like this. And here now you can see this better. That's basically that mark here is right behind the red pointer as it should be but the other day when I was when I was filming when I was making this video um, with this audio generator here and sometimes it looked like I had it at an angle and it would seem like it was off which is was irritating for me and probably irritating for the viewer too viewers too so I'm gonna go ahead and get my um, voltmeter out and show that there so now I'm using my old Kaiyu Ritsu FET VOM and you can see this got he has a mirror here this is the anti-parallax mirror and if I would look at the if I look at this mirror close from the angle I'm at right right now I can see the here the needle here the dial pointer that's I can see it reflected in a mirror on the other side that means I'm not looking at it straight on. I don't know if I can show this a little bit closer right here. You can see this right, basically right there at the tip of my, there's like a black line going up next to the needle here. Basically right there. That's telling me I'm off. And so what basically I have to do, I got to try to go in front now move the camera as to where I can't I cannot see that reflection no more then I know I'm reading it um, I'm reading it correctly basically unfortunately I can't focus any closer with this uh, camera of mine I wish I could but it's not it's not possible anyways um, that basically concludes this um, video here Probably a lot of people that have been doing electronics for a while or a lot of the old timers, they know what parallax error is. But this video isn't or wasn't intended for them. This was another spontaneous video I just made. Anyways, thank you so much for watching.